friends, plugging up a formula and then doing sums is easy, but to understand a concept and then apply it is more important. So today, I here Antani will explain you one of the important topics of the chapter probability from the standard 12th. So, but before understanding pro, uh, Bayes' theorem, let us understand total probability theorem. Total probability theorem states that when an event A occurs under the influence of various events like B1, B2 up to Bn, then probability of event A is given by probability of event A equals probability of event B1 into probability of A given B1 plus probability of B2 into probability of A given B2 up to up to probability of Bn into probability of A given Bn. This theorem is also called multiplication rule of probability. To understand the total probability theorem more clearly, let us solve an example. So, the question goes, of the students in a college, it is known that 60% reside in hostel and 40% are day scholars. Previous year results report that 30% of the students who reside in hostel attain A grade and 20% of the day schoolers attain A grade in their annual examination. At the end of the year, a student is selected at random. Find the probability that the student has an A grade. So the solution will be event A will be selected student has A grade. Pro event B1 will be selected students live in a hostel. Event B2 will be selected student is a day scholar. As it is given in the question, 60% reside in hostel and 40% reside in are day scholars. Then probability of B1 will be 60 by 100 and probability of B2 will be 40 by 100. Also, it is given in the question that 30% of the hostelers attain A grade and 20% of the day scholars attain A grade. Then probability of A given B1 will be 30 by 100 and probability of A given B2 will be 20 by 100. So, applying total probability theorem in this question, probability of event A will be given by probability of B1 into probability of A given B1 plus probability of B2 into probability of A given B2, which finally turns out to be 26 by 100. So now, we have understood the total probability theorem. Now, let's understand Bayes' theorem. Bayes' theorem states that it is known that event A has occurred. Then, probability of event BY is given by probability of BI given A equals probability of BI into probability of A given BI upon probability of B1 into probability of A given B1 plus probability of B2 into probability of A given B2 up to probability of Bn into probability of A given Bn, where i can be 1, 2, 3, up to up to n. Now, let us solve an example based on Bayes' theorem. So, the question is, given three identical boxes, 1, 2 and 3, each containing two coins. In box 1, both coins are of gold. In box 2, both are silver coins and in box 3, there is one gold and a one silver coin. A person chooses a box at random and takes out a coin. If the coin is of gold, what is the probability that the other coin in the box is also of gold? So the solution is, event A is coin drawn is of gold. Event B1, box 1 is chosen. Event B2, box 2 is chosen. Event B3, box 3 is chosen. As the boxes are selected at random, the probability of each box B1, B2 and B3 will be 1 by 3. In box 1, both coins are of gold. So probability of event A given B1 will be 1. As there are no gold coins in box 2, its probability A given B2 will be 0. And in box 3, there is 1 silver and 1 gold coin. So the probability A given B3 will be 1 by 2. Applying Bayes' theorem in the given question, probability of event B1 given A will be given by probability of B1 into probability of A given B1 upon probability of B1 into probability of A given B1 plus probability of B2 into probability of A given B2 plus probability of B3 into probability of A given B3. Substituting the values of each of the following, the answer turns out to be 2 by 3.